Brad Hall out here at J-Man RV inside our huge showroom. Today we're going to look at a half ton pull coach for your family. Uh, this coach coming in at 5,400 pounds, this Keystone Bullet 277 BHS is a great coach. So let's take a look around the outside, then we'll go to the inside and see what we think. So as you can see, we have a uh, bank of two propane balls here, 20 pound, plenty of uh, propane to run your stoves and your furnaces and stuff like that for a great camping trip. Also have a place down here for a brand new marine battery. Then you also have an outside light uh, so you can see what you're doing at night for hookup. Also has a diamond plate rock chip guard here. Uh, keep the rock chips off the face of your coach and keep it looking good. Uh, and it's also in black so don't reflect in your rear view mirror while you're going down the road. So over here we're going to have your other side, your storage. Uh, so your storage is huge in this camper. As you can see, it's uh, passed through all the way. It also has these magnet latches, which is a great feature. Uh, you also have your fresh water fill, city water fill. This coach also has a black tank flush. Uh, benefits to you on the black tank flush is going to do easier doing the maintenance and cleaning the sludge and stuff out of your black tank. It also has an outside hot and cold shower on this side, on the off door side. So uh, you don't have any water or stuff where you rinse off the dogs or clean fish on the side that you walk on. So let's go look the other side. Uh, Bullet has uh, got the biggest in his class in three things. Uh, so those three things are going to use the number 43. We're going to start with your underbelly storage that we've seen from the underside. 43 cubic foot of underbelly storage, largest in its class, with linoleum run all the way through from front to back in this coach. So there's no seams, all your walls are set on top of it. Uh, the number 243 is the spread of your axles. So the spread of the axles is 43 inches, largest in its class. Benefits to use a smoother ride. Better when it's set up, more stable, uh, and it also hits one pothole at a time. Uh, so the other 43 is your freshwater holding tank. Freshwater holding tank on this is 43 gallons, again, biggest in its class. So these three things are one of the better parts of this coach. You also have a full aluminum frame, uh, full metal truss roof, 3 8 deck, so it's a walkable roof. You also have a, a big departure on your uh, radius metal on the front and on the back for entering and exiting. It's also more aerodynamic. It does have the heated and closed underbelly also. Upgraded furnace, 30,000 BTU, so you can keep your heat in the basement to keep your water lines and your tanks from freezing, as well as keep the upper side of the coach uh, warm for you. You're also gonna have a shock on your door, so if you got a handful of groceries, you can release this door, walk in with your groceries, and not have to worry about the door. You also have an automatic one-button push awning with a full LED light strip, as you can see all the way underneath, and it also uh, reflects really nice off the white material. Up here, you're looking at two marine grade speakers uh, on the left and the right. Uh, so that's connected to the stereo systems uh, or your DVDs or your movies. So you can play inside or out with those. Uh, it also comes with a gas and electric water heater. Um, you also have the forged pink aluminum wheels. Not only do they look good, it's also performance driven. Keeps those brakes a little cooler, a lot bigger area uh, inside these uh, aluminum wheels than the steel to pull more air in. So back here on this coach, great thing. You have the kids, you have the family, you're at the lake. Outside here, you're going to have your two burner top stove, keep the heat and the smell out of your coach. You also can be outside underneath your awning, as you can see, it extends over this. You also have a rinse and wash sink here uh, to be able to rinse and wash while you're doing your food prep. And you also have a shelf back here to be able to put some of your stuff. Drinks for the kids and the grown ups on the outside, keep the cold in and the bugs out during the summer so you can get your, your food and some of your drinks out here instead of going in and out of the coach. And last but not least, <coughs> excuse me, you also have a outside. Uh, stainless steel Aussie grill out here. Uh, this is quick connect to propane right underneath the coach. So as long as you have a bottle on, this is going to produce uh, gas for your cooktop and for your barbecue grill. Uh, you also have the 80% tint glass, as you can see, which really knocks down the glare uh, on a, a warm summer day. So it keeps this thing nice and cool. So that's some of the stuff on the outside. So let's go inside and see what we can find. So now we're inside the coach. So let's look at some of the great features inside this coach. So first off, we're going to look at these large size of bunks, top and bottom right here, the ladder to access both of them. So this is good up to 300 pounds. So this is gonna hold any grown ups or large kids. So you get plenty of room. Right here in the bathroom is beside it. So the bathroom is pushed all the way at the back. So it gives it more room in the living room area. You got a nice tub shower, foot flush toilet. And you also have a nice French wash sink with a nice vanity top with a mirror. So you can get your uh, toothbrush, toothpaste and goodies for the bathroom out of. So over here we have your dinette table. Uh, as you can see, this is in the booth style uh, with cabinet drawer doors underneath on both sides, put extra storage. This table will let down, cushions will come in. This will make a great bed area also for the rest of the family. Uh, over here on this side for storage for everybody's clothes and all your, all your food. So here we have some shelves 
and a cabinet down below. And then we also have a pantry here with adjustable shelves. So if you don't have as much food, you can take two shelves out and hang some clothes. Use the bottom two shelves for some food. Over here, we're gonna have your gas and electric refrigerator. So this is a great size refrigerator, freezer, plenty of room to store a bunch of food for a week's worth of food or a nice long weekend with a bunch of people. So this will work on gas or electric, either or. Coming into the kitchen, you're gonna find you have cabinets up above, cabinets down below with nice size shelves and doors inside. You also have another cabinet storage underneath the sink with a shelf again. And then this, underneath the sink, you're gonna have two drawers that pull out for some extra storage down below. All wood construction steel roller bearing guys, so you can fill those with some weight. They're not gonna break down on you. <coughs> so right here you have your glass stove top. Uh, gives you that extra room uh, while you're doing food prep, you need some extra room. If you're using a stove top, this rolls right up out of the way. Also a great uh, backsplash uh, for any grease or anything that might get up on the wall. You can clean this glass really easy. Then down below we also have your nice size oven. Uh, you know, biscuits, toast, frozen pizzas, anything you want to do, you can put in here and get that taken care of for the kids and the family. Uh, then you have your huge deep basin sink. This deep basin sink is going to hold all your pots and pans for all that cooking you're going to do for the weekend. Gooseneck faucet sink, so you can get that out of the way, so you can get your bigger pots and pans in. And of course, it comes with a cover, again, for extra counter space if you need it, but it's also a good chopping board. So right behind you, you're going to see the entertainment system. Uh, the entertainment system, uh, including the TV and then a residential sound bar down below, which is your uh, Bluetooth, AM, FM, DV, you know, everything is there, uh, HDMI, auxiliary in, so you're going to be able to have all kinds of, of music and uh, pair to your phone and as well as the TV. As you can see right now, we're just on the antenna, so you can also just pick up regular channels wherever you're at. This does have a 15,000 BTU AC, uh, biggest in, its, in the market and it also is ducted throughout the ceiling. While we're looking up here at the ceiling, you're also gonna have LED lights. The benefit to you with the LED lights are gonna be the fact that the LED lights pull less, less power from this coach for more things to work. It also gonna give you thousands of hours and they're not producing any heat whatsoever, so you're not gonna be fighting the heat in the summer. Uh, so those are three great things about the LED lights. Then you have another couch right here. Uh, this couch would make a great bed for extra sleeping again. So let's put that out real quick and see how it works. So it's just easy taking the cushions off, grabbing the strap, pulling this up, putting out your legs. And there you have a nice bed with four inch memory foam, great pallet to start a bed for anybody. So let's put that up. You see how easy it was to, to break out. So it's very, very simple, easy to use, and a great couch to have for extra sleeping capacity. And just as simple as that. So last but not least, let's go to the bedroom area. In here in the bedroom area, you have a full queen bed here. Uh, you got cabinets all the way around. Again, LED lights, air conditioning vents. Down here on your left, you have a storage pass through. So you can put a hamper down there and throw your dirty clothes right into the underbelly storage in that huge 43 inch uh, cubic uh, square foot of storage. Then over here, you also have pocket doors for privacy, but you also have another area to put a second TV and there's a hole right here to feed through to hook everything up with the other TV. Hey folks, I hope this gives you a great look at this 277 Bullet by Keystone. If this is the camera for you, please give me a call at 888-293-2211 or brad.hall at jmatrv.com. And if this is not the coach for you, I have 400 more. So give me a call. Let's do some business. Have a great weekend.